Hello and welcome everyone to another edition of Garvin Plays Minecraft here on the FTW Craft server. And today we hit a jackpot. Finally, finally we hit a jackpot here in our little zombie villager farm that uh, we've we've been piecemealing together basically. So I was able to get uh, a villager uh, from the from the the main starter farm that I was setting up, I was able to get one together working. Ooh, careful! Uh, we'll figure this out. But anyways, I, I was able to get one up here using him as bait, and now we've we've got one who just kind of randomly appeared out here. I don't know. I thought it was lit pretty well, but uh, apparently not. So, uh, so we've got this guy who randomly appeared, and I was able to push him into a cart. We've got another zombie villager over there. We've got one in here. Oh, hey. And then I think there was there was another somewhere around here. So we might have four that we can bring out. So we're going to be working on that today. Uh, should be fun. Should be a lot of fun. Actually, I'm curious if I could if I can cure this guy inside here. But for now, we're going to we're going to leave him go. We're going to I'm gonna try to uh, work our way through through these guys. Oh man, they're coming from over there. Interesting. I'm uh, interested to see what is not lit well. Maybe we can sneak over there and figure it out. All right, but yeah, today's today's project we have uh, we have a new house that we set up that we need to. Um, well, actually, we didn't really set it up per se. Uh, it's the old spider farm. I put in some new uh, new fencing uh, to keep the. Hello, hello, I got you. Uh, to keep the. This is our. This is the the guy we want. You stay out there. We jump in here. Okay, these guys all good. Look good. Oh, oh dear. Okay. So it's, it's the back one we want. All right. Let's sneak in here. Can we push these guys out? Nope. All right. Let's not hit the one we want. Let's hit the one we don't want. Cool. All right. So we got one over there. We got one in the back. But anyways, yeah, we set up the spider farm to uh, allow... Ah. Uh, need to figure out a better way to do this. Oh dear. Oh man, I'm not sure. I'm not sure which one to get. Uh, okay, we can get this back one. Okay, we can get that back one. Guy with the crown. We can get the guy with the crown. Okay. And then there's two. Then there was two. All right, let's try and get Oh, thank God. Okay, cool. We've got them. We've got each one that we want. So let's go ahead and uh can I not pick up the crown? Let's throw some of this stuff away. All right. I need potion of weakness. So, we did not bring that. Wait, we've got a potion of weakness in here. If only was a way I could get these guys to move in together. Uh, and golden apples. So, let me go get another potion of weakness. Actually, we need two more. And hopefully they don't despawn on us. Right, let's remember we need to we need to bring that with us next time. So, anyways, this is really exciting. Uh, I'm I'm surprised that it's it's happening so well. Um, well, not necessarily surprised, but uh, I don't know. Oh, God bless it! And I just poisoned myself. Uh, okay, let's get let's get this guy first, and we'll block him in. Okay, that looks good. So, oh man, 
Actually, let's get this guy because we're already here. So we'll get this guy first. Uh, potion of weakness. Okay. Instantaneous. Gotta love that. Alright. Oh! Alright, this one might kill us, but we're going to try it anyways. Instantaneous. Love it. Oh no, did he go upstairs? Oh, you jerk. Alright, we'll have to figure out how to get that guy back down. But, that just leaves us with uh, the one in the minecart. Alright, come on, get out of the way. And this one fell. Where did he fall? Oh, hey. I see you. Alright. This is going to be super rough. Let me try and figure out how to get him uh, into a minecart. The reason why it's super rough is because... Oh, I don't have any other minecarts. Uh, uh, um, no... Hold on. And do I have any more blocks? This is what killed us last time. Shoot. Shoot. I'm going to do this and he's going to escape. All right, that works for me. All right, we'll save him for there. We'll get him later. We've got two over here. Oh, this is so cool. All right, now I got to run outside. Anyways, this is what we're going to be doing today. I think, I think everyone will be safe in there. So let's run out here. I'll show you the work that I did off camera. And that's a lot of sand. Where, where did all this sand come from? We'll need to remember to cover this up. That's weird. Where did all that go? Maybe I was digging underneath. That's possible, too. All right. So, uh, first of all, I did some changes in here. So, I've got my two uh, my two blacksmiths in here. And they'll be rather nice. Uh, I've got this space ready to go. I've got this space ready to go. We could probably fit two in here. Actually, this is not ready to go. I need to finish this one up. Um, this one is not ready to go, and this this one is not ready to go. I got to finish these guys up, but over here I did a little bit more work, and we've got like th this one is basically finished. I I don't know if I've if I want to divide these up yet. So like this is a stall, this is a stall, this is a stall, this is a stall. I think that makes more sense. I think that makes more sense. Um, hmm. Yeah, let's let's do that. So we're we're gonna divide these up into individual stalls. Let me get some uh, stained clay. I'm thinking. Let me see. Is there? Any, do I have? Here, we'll use yellow. I think yellow will be good. So we'll individualize these. That way, we can have a better idea of of who's where. Oops. All right, so we've got room for all four, all four in here. So let's go. Let's go ahead and uh, can we do a track? Can we do a track across glass? I doubt it. Nope. Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and set this up. I'm gonna take some of this track down, set it up so I can uh, track these guys in, and then we'll start bringing them in. And then our, our marketplace is pretty much ready to go. Uh, that will take our total up to, let's see, there was two, four, five, six, seven. So we got seven, so eight, nine, 10, 11. That'll take us up to 11. I'd like to get 15 
15 to 20. Uh, I think that's that's my hope. So anyways, let me go ahead and set this up, get this track laid out so that we can we can go ahead and uh, start bringing these guys in. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Be right back. Sadly, we lost one. We lost the uh, the zombie that was inside of the minecart. Just despawned. Uh, I dropped some stuff off from my inventory and picked up the the potions. And by the time I got back, he was gone. So, really sad. Really sad uh, situation, but it is what it is, I guess. So we've got we've got three still. And you, sir, must move. All right. Let's go ahead and push everybody out. And this is probably a bad move, but we're going to do it anyways. All right, cool. So you're stuck there. Let me grab this guy. All right, let me uh, push you in. So, another blacksmith. Nothing too fancy. All right. Cool. So... Uh, we got one in. Always, uh, always a plus. Actually, we can make this stone brick. Do we still have stone brick? Good, 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 good. Yeah. So um, overall, though, I think uh, I think the progress of this entire endeavor uh, is going a lot better than I originally expected. You know, especially if you look at the at the at the last time we were we were doing this. Or actually, every time that we've we've tried to transport villagers um it, it was just you know one one issue after another so i i'm i'm happy that we're getting we're getting better <laughs> you know we're getting better at this this entire uh and this entire thing cuz you know it, you can only fail so hard before it you know you you're you're done you know you don't want to do this anymore so but we're not there yet we still got we still got time. All right, let's uh Oh, oh dear. Um let's drop the seeds. We don't need those. Okay, cool. And some cobble there. Stone brick here. Actually, we can do we can do a stone, and how did I miss something? Oh, stone brick slab. Gotcha. All right, so now we just have to move one into this little corner plot, and I think that's gonna that's probably gonna end uh, this this part of the project. I mean, we can always get some more villagers, but I'd rather walk you guys through something else that um, we're gonna go we're gonna go around. Something else that I've been working on, um, or at least thinking about, so you know we can we can kind of brainstorm together. I've got I've got some ideas of what I want to do, but now it's just a matter of of doing them, you know. So uh, this guy's gonna be difficult, just because we're gonna have to we're gonna have to force this guy. To grab a cart, so let's let's put the cart there. Oh, quick, quick, quick! Oh shoot! Get him! Get him! Yeah! Look at that, buddy! Oh no! That's okay. We got him on the cart this time, though. Wait. 
What has just taken place? Did I lose track of him? He's already in here? I, I'm losing my mind right now, if that's the case. Oh, here he is. No. So whatever this physics is, where it just kind of walks through you on the minecart, I do not like that. I'm guessing that's a bug. Because sometimes it works fine. Like this, this is working perfectly. Oh, God bless it. Get in there. Come on. You can do it. Hmm. It's like it's this direction. This direction is causing it some, some grief. All right. Which doesn't make sense because it's the same direction as the other. As the other guy, so get back on. Alright, cool. Cool. Great. Hmm. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and put our, our stoppage there. And then for this last this last guy, um, you know, whenever we get another villager. Do I have food? Right, there we go. So with this last villager, I'll just loop around so he'll come in this last stall. But I think I think uh, two two spots for each villager is, is an okay setup. I think that's uh, roomy enough. Could be wrong, but I think, it's, I think it should be okay. Oh, hey, grass. Got the grass back. Awesome. All right. Let's go ahead and put the sand back. Ah, oh, dear. But yeah, overall, uh, I think this is going to be cool. You know, it's not necessarily something that everyone on the server is going to want to use all the time, but it's going to be something nice that that we can that we can take advantage of for sure. Let's take that on this one. At least prep for this this area. Cool. All right. So, but yeah, this is nice, like uh, secondary stall, and maybe maybe we can put another one right here in this corner. So so that way, when you're walking in, man, a little bit of lag there. Uh, as soon as you're walking in, you you've got access to a blacksmith, access to uh, this. I think it's a farmer access to the butcher or leather worker we've got another one here uh, and then one right here and I think that'll work out well plus still access to the spider spawner whenever whenever we want to you know do that so we'll go ahead and get that get that set up so we can remember to do this but yeah anyways I think this is a I think this is gonna be pretty cool I think this is a, a cool cool shop that can hold multiple uh, multiple guys in it, so it's like a uh, you know lower rent, lower rent part of the building. So, all right, let me uh, let me get rid of some of my inventory, clean up uh, the mess that I just created, and then meet you guys uh, out out somewhere on the farm. I think I think we're going to meet out out on the farm. So, stay tuned. So this is normal, right? <laughs> I just uh, I I took down these stairs, and noticed that the vines were still growing. So I don't know if we sign back off and back on, uh, if if they'll go away. But I don't think this is uh, I don't think this is natural. <laughs> so, anyways, uh, I've been doing a little bit more work in the house. Just kind of wanted to show that off to you guys real quick. So, got a little fishing pond that I'm still. Still uh, unsure about. I haven't started using yet. But over here, um, I made this like into a, a nice little landing. So uh, these these wooden walls go all the way up to the ceiling, and obviously this is this is our top level where our, where our bedroom is. 
my my thought right now is I'm gonna take out all of the stone ground and put in slabs. And if you remember exactly where we are, we're right above. Uh, let's just jump down. We're right above here. So uh, I think the slab look will will look pretty cool. So we'll probably keep that. But that's not what uh, I want to show you guys. That just I don't know. I just started doing it for some reason. So we're gonna continue. But anyways, let's uh, let's run outside real quick. <sighs> know we're running a little bit long on on record time. So out here, um, obviously uh, we we've made the the farm uh, a bit bigger, and I like it. I like it a lot. I like that uh, we we extended the farm all the way up to the road. Um, there are some obvious uh, issues like us cutting through the water probably isn't a good uh, a good thing to do. Um, but you know, overall, I think I think this is nice. This is a nice look. I think uh, we're we're doing some good things. So it got me thinking. Um, I would love to ex not necessarily extend the farm all the way around, but um, you know, maybe extend the the Zen Garden to be all the way around the house. So let's just take a quick quick peek around. Uh, you know, obviously it's all sand. You know, we're in the middle of the desert, but it would be kind of cool, I think, to have uh, you know, like just a, a little grassy area that's well lit, and uh, you know. We could probably plant some trees. That way, we have a better tree source. Look at that! It's a nice little little cove there. Uh, you know, just like a, a a nice a nice area that we can walk walk around and not feel like we're being chased out by creepers. Uh, I guess it's just a matter of how how would we really want to accomplish that? Do we want to go up? Or do we want to stay at, you know, that general level ground? Um, you know, we do go up a little to get to the same level that is at the at the Zen Garden. But, you know, over here, it's 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 pretty much at uh, somewhat elevated, but still right around that that level over here. And I think what would be cool is if we we take we take this whole area and just put grass grass and trees all the way around and make like a little nice nice circle we can wall it in with uh, with cobble walls um, but you know just just something nice uh, I think trees would be kind of cool too maybe maybe what we could do is say every subscriber we get on YouTube we can we can dedicate a tree to so I could put up a tree, maybe put uh, a little little sign on it that says who it who it is, uh, when they subscribed, uh, that sort of thing. I think I think that would be a, a nice a nice little give back that that we could do, you know, because there <laughs> there really isn't much. It really isn't much that we we can do as far as give giving back to to you guys for subscribing and taking the time to like or leave comments but i think i think that'd be a nice little tribute for you guys so uh anyways that's not what we're going to be working on uh right now well, that's a that's a, a future project hopefully we can get that started soon but i think that'll make this area look a lot nicer um you know we would definitely want to cover up uh this little waterway somehow or maybe we can just get rid of it i don't think it's as necessary as it once was because we're not out here being chased by creepers and zombies. And once we get this new circle garden set up, uh, we won't really have to worry about that anymore. So, all right, well, that's it for uh, for this episode. That's a future project is the, is the circle Zen garden. I think that's going to be kind of slick. Uh, maybe replace some of the sand with, uh, with dirt, but... Kind of liking it, kind of liking the sand in, in some spots. So we might we might mix it up a bit. So, anyways, that's it for me. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.